So uh, you're, here's how to put together your pith ball demonstrator. You're going to need the following materials. Aluminum foil. Now, the best kind of aluminum foil to get is the thinnest you can possibly get. You can go to this dollar store and get the super cheap kind. Or, uh, or you can use regular thick aluminum foil. It'll work okay. Um, the best foil to use is the kind, if you can peel it off a gum wrapper, you know, that stuff's really thin. Um, so that'll work really well. But aluminum foil. You need, um, uh, you need styrofoam. Uh, you can get it like, like this from a styrofoam cup or you need something really light it's going to take up uh, some volume uh, and you need silk thread uh, you need some wire of some kind now I say silk thread silk is the best uh, the kind of thread to use for, for making this. You can use cotton thread, it'll still work. And that's the most common, but if, if you happen to have somebody around who's got some uh, silk thread, uh, it will, it'll work a little better. It'll, the pith balls will hold on to their charge a little bit longer. Um, I've actually seen people uh, use um, like a cereal box doesn't have to be. You can just use wire to make it. You need to make some kind of stand for it, though. And uh, so let me sketch it out. Um, I've seen some people use a cereal box. So let me sketch this out. It's nice and big here. So here's your cereal. It doesn't have to be, I mean, whatever. Cardboard box just to use as a stand. So it can stand up on a table all by itself. It needs to be fairly tall. Don't use a little box. Use something that's, you know, good, good size. And then you want to tape your your wire. It can be coat hanger wire or whatever. Tape it so it, it it's pretty far out there. And then you can have like a uh, well. You can just it, it could just be a wire that hangs straight out there like that. Now, then you have what are called pith balls. They used to use the pith from the inside of a corn stalk or something like that, but now we use styrofoam. If you take little chunks of styrofoam, uh, try to form it into a little ball. You can take like several layers. Uh, if, you have, if you take apart a styrofoam cup, you can put together like a little chunk of, of a, and, and kind of make, try to make a little ball out of it maybe a quarter inch in diameter uh, will be fine and then you uh, take your thread and sometimes I'll take a sewing needle with the thread and put it through the styrofoam and then you you wrap the thread around the styrofoam until it comes out so it goes through and grips onto the styrofoam and comes out and then you take your aluminum foil and you, you surround it. You make a ball, a styrofoam ball that's covered with aluminum foil with the thread coming out of it. So here's the foil covered styrofoam ball with a thread coming through it. Now, quite often, I'll take a, our students will take just one piece of thread, you know, and, and have it, you know, come over here, and then put the other ball on the other side. So here's your chunks of styrofoam. Cover it with aluminum foil, and you have this thread. And again, if you're, if anybody in your family is into sewing, uh, they probably have silk thread and that will work the best. Now you want to make this short enough so that it doesn't touch the, the table. So let's say here's your table. You know, you're going to bring this to school. And here's, you know, here's your table. 
and you want this to, to hang over your 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 wire um, like this and then hang oh good two or three inches above the ground and they'll 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 just hang uh, off of this from here and then what we're going to do is uh, I'm going to you know we're going to get bring uh, some balloons I'll bring some balloons to class you blow up a balloon you rub it on your head collect the static electric charge and you can charge these and you can make them separate and then you can put uh, you know different kinds of charge on them they're a lot of fun to play with but um, this needs to be about oh probably approximately four to five inches from here to here and you need a, a good oh let's make it three inches three to four inches above the table and that will make a good um, pit bull demonstrator and uh, you know now if you want to take a, a, just this wire and loop it down and make a stand out of it that'll work too some people have done that they don't want the cereal box and or whatever you just need it just needs to stand up on its own really well and if this is too heavy you just put something in your cereal box to give it enough weight to hold it up so that's the pit ball demonstrator so um, on so the next time you come to class Okay, if you bring your pith ball demonstrator or your electroscope and it's finished, you're going to get five points. If you don't have it, you just don't get those points. You get zero. There's no, there's no makeup for it. Usually I accept late work, but this is for an activity. And um, so uh, there's just no... Um, forgiveness you know, if you don't have it then we can't do the activity so we'll have to use something that belongs to another student so make making this is worth five points any questions okay that is all